Life as a single mum has its ups and downs. It's just me and my two boys, and whilst I'd love to give them the world, living on a single income doesn't make it easy. I work as hard as I can, but still struggle to make ends meet, and the bills keep on coming. To make matters worse, I noticed my water bill was going up, and I couldn't work out why. Nothing had changed. It was really strange. I wouldn't say we use water excessively, just for flushing, having showers, and washing the dishes and clothes. I needed to take action quickly to avoid falling into debt, so I contacted my water company and asked them for help. They took a look at my last meter reading and suggested sending someone from their team to carry out a water efficiency audit and conduct some tests around the home. I'm so glad I got in touch. They discovered we had a leaky loo and also suggested ways in which we could use less water. Jason now takes shorter showers. We all turn off the tap when brushing our teeth and I make sure my washer is full before turning it on. It's made a real difference to my water bills. I'm now paying £18 less a month, a saving of £216 a year. I'm even starting to see a change in my energy bill too, as we're using far less hot water. This couldn't have come at a better time. Water efficiency measures can help customers to save money on both their water and energy bills. But more needs to be done to make these support measures accessible to those who need them most. Whilst government funding for energy efficiency schemes is available, it does not fund improvements to household water efficiency. We must do more to help people join the journey to net zero and end water poverty once and for all.